Hi, I'm Chris Gura, and let's get started answering the Starnet question, how to view recorded video. One, click or open a play tab. You can have up to four play tabs open at one time. If you do not see a play tab, you can open one by right clicking next to the last open tab and select play. Or another way, you can click on system and select new tab, then play. Two, in the site column, locate the recording device that you want to view recorded video for. Three, click and drag the recording device into the first box in the play tab. Or if you wanted to view only a single camera, you can also drag and drop an individual camera into the first box as well. Four, video from the cameras on your recording device will automatically populate in the play tab. You'll notice several playback options appear at the bottom right of a selected window with various options. A quick side note, you can go full screen by double clicking on a camera screen. Double click again to return to the smaller screen. Five, at the bottom of the window, you will see a timeline and various playback buttons. These are the tools you will use to search a recorded video. Touching on a few features, you'll probably first notice the timeline. Here you can scrub through recorded video by just clicking and dragging the red vertical timeline marker. Looking above the timeline, you'll see the play button and shuttle knob. The play button will play the video and the shuttle knob is used to go forward and backward in the recorded video. And for those keyboard enthusiasts, you can also use keyboard shortcuts. To play slash pause, you can press control plus the spacebar simultaneously. To move forward or backwards one frame, you press two buttons simultaneously. Control plus the right or left arrow key respectively. More keyboard shortcuts can be found in the playback button drop down boxes. Lastly, I'll cover the different colors you may see on the timeline. Many times it's mostly blue, but here are some color insights. Blue means time lapse recorded video. Magenta or purple means an event action. Green means an abnormal action such as infrastructure, a camera, or recorder issue. Red means panic recording. And finally, yellow means a pre-event action. Thanks for watching our tech tips video. This is Chris Skura, signing out.